हेलो एवरीवन हेयर इज चंदन सिंह वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू इन आर ऑफिशियल यूट्यूब चैनल ऑनलाइन प्लस स्टडी टुडे आई एम इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू विद बेस्ट कंप्यूटर अवेयरनेस क्वेश्चन व्हिच इज़ वेरी हेल्पफुल इन योर कंपिटेटिव एग्जाम्स लाइक क्लर्क आईबीपीएस एसबीआई एफसीआई पीएसपीसीएल और अदर एग्जाम्स सो फर्स्टली यू सब्सक्राइब दिस चैनल प्रेस बेल आइकन शेयर वीडियो एंड क्लिक लाइक बटन टूडे दिस इज फोर्थ पार्ट एंड दो स्टूडेंट हु हैवन सीन बैक साइड पार्ट क्लिक फिंगर ऑन डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स एंड सी अदर वीडियोज सो इन दिस पार्ट वी हैव ट्वेंटी क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्सटी वन टू एटी सो वी स्टडी अबाउट दिस क्वेश्चन सो क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्सटी वन इज अ डैश इज एनी थिंग दैट कैन केस हार्म द ऑप्शन आर वेबिलिटी फिश थ्रिएट स्पूफ एंड ऑल ऑफ द एबव so what is its answer please comment its answer is threat a threat is anything that can cause harm okay so question number 62 is in the right setting a thief will steal your information be simply watching what you type so options are snagging spying social engineering shoulder surfing and none of these so what is its answer its answer is option number 4 shoulder surfing so next question is question number 63 dash a hacker contacts you my phone or emails and attempts to acquire your password options are swooping phishing spamming bugging and none of these so what is its answer its answer is option number 2 phishing so next question is question number 64 the power protection device includes a battery that provides a few minutes of the power options are surge pressure line conditioner generator UPS and none of these. So what is its answer? Please comment. Its answer is option number four, UPS. Okay, students. So today's next question is question number sixty-five. A hacker that changes or forges information in an electronic resource is engaging in dash. Options are denial of service, sniffing. terrorism data diddling and none of these so what is its answer its answer is option number 4 data diddling so next question is the dash of a threat measures its potential impact on a system options are vulnerabilities countermeasures degree of harm susceptibility and none of these so its answer is option number 3 degree of harm so today's next question is question number 67 which of the following identifies a specific web page and its computer on the web options are website website address url domain name and all of the above so what is its answer please comment its answer is domain name so 68th question software such as explorer and firefox are referred to as system software utility software browser internet tools and none of these so what is its answer please comment its answer is option number 3 browser so today's 69th question is which following sp is free options are composer aol netjor msn and none of these so its answer is option number 3 msn msn following isp is free so today's 70th question is 
when internet data leaves your compass it normally goes to dash before moving toward its destination options are internet backbone network access point base station communication system and none of these so what is its answer its answer is option number 2 network access point so today's next question is mci and at and t are examples of which of the following social network communication system internet service providers mobile sorts and none of these so its answer is option number 3 internet service providers so same two question is which type of telecommunication hardware allows you to access the web options are browser modem ftp protocol irc all of the above so what is its answer its answer is option number 2 modem so 73 question is email addresses separate the username from the isp using the dash symbol and at the rate percentage multiplication and none of these so what is its answer please comment its answer is option number 2 at the rate so question number 74 is the mail server as defined in the text used is the dash protocol options are http ftp pop smtp all of the above so its answer is option number 3 pop okay so question number 75 is when sending an email the dash line describes the contents of the message to subject contents cc all of the above so its answer is option number 2 subject so today's next question is question number 76 unsolicited comerical email is commonly known as dash junk hoaxes spam hypertext all of the above so what is its answer please comment its answer is option number 3 spam so 77 question is news servers utilize dash to distribute documents to readers options are nntp nws news http ftp none of these so its answer is option number 1 nntp okay students so today 78th question is discussion groups may have a dash who monitors the posting and enforces the site's rules options are judge censor narrator censor and none of these so its censor is option number 2 censor okay students so today's 79th question is a message with replies on a news group is open called a dash options are post list thread comment all of above so its answer is option number 3 thread so today's last question is question number 80 the internet was originally a project for this government agency options are arpa nsf nsa f double c and none of these so what is its answer please comment as early as its answer is arpa so at last you subscribe this channel press bell icon share this video to all friends so thanks for watching this video